everybody, it's Rocky. So last night I made some stuffed portobello mushroom caps and when I was thinking about the ingredients that I wanted to stuff the mushrooms with, I kind of really thought about lasagna ingredients, like what I usually put in my lasagna, which is ricotta cheese and parmesan, mozzarella, meat sauce, and then I also put in some spinach. And when Rich came home, you know, he saw that it was stuffed mushroom caps and he took a bite out of it and right away he said this tastes like lasagna, which was great because that's what I was going for. <laughs> and I think a lot of us think that Italian food is one of the things you kind of have to stay away from when you're trying to eat healthy or, you know, you're trying to lose weight. And the thing is, if you just kind of get those ingredients that remind you of a lasagna, then that's really all you need. So if you want to see how I make my version of lasagna-inspired mushroom caps, then just keep on watching. So right now I'm just prepping my mushroom caps. I'm going to remove the stem like that. Just kind of twist it around a bit and it automatically comes out. Now I'm going to remove the gills, which are these brown things right there. So you're just going to take a spoon and just run it through and get those bad boys out. And this is going to allow room for your stuffing. Now I'm going to spray down both sides of the mushrooms with some olive oil spray. Now I'm taking some crushed garlic and dropping a little bit down onto each one. And I'm just going to rub that around just to give the mushroom caps themselves some extra flavor. I'm going to pop these guys in a 400 degree oven for about five minutes on each side. And what this is going to do is dry them out a little bit so then they're not watery when you go to eat them. I am putting down two cups of frozen spinach that I just thawed out in a microwave uh, into my bowl. Now I'm adding some fat-free ricotta cheese. Now I'm adding some shaved Parmesan black pepper and some egg and then give it all a good mix. I thawed out some Morningstar sausage links in the microwave and now I'm going to just chop them up until they're nice and crumbly. So I just poured out about a cup of spaghetti sauce, just regular jarred spaghetti sauce that I got from the grocery store. And now I'm going to add my Morningstar crumbles to that. And just mix this together. I just pulled my mushroom caps out of the oven and look at this. See that's all the water that released from them. That's why you want to bake them first. Get all that water out of them. So we're going to stuff our caps. We're just going to put down the ricotta and the spinach mixture first. And then we're going to put down our meat sauce. And now we're going to sprinkle down some light shredded mozzarella cheese. Okay, now these guys are ready to go into the oven 400 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. And here we go. They're fresh out of the oven. You can see the cheese is just melting off of them. They look so good. I cannot wait to dig in. So if anybody has any questions, just go ahead and post them below. Uh, the pictures and the full recipe will be on my blog spot, which I'll post a link to below. And until next time, enjoy.